Hi friends, it's Claire from Scrappy Nerd UK and today I have a Hey Little Magpie haul video to share with you. So um, they recently had an offer on um, on the bank holiday weekend and I knew that I wanted to pick up some of the new Echo Park, well it's not well, newish Echo Park um, papers. So um, I don't need any more papers but um, I saw some of these and I couldn't resist. So first of all I'll take you through the papers and then I'll show you some of the other bits that I've got. Um, so I got this paper here from Simple Stories called Oh Baby and it's the 3 by four elements and I've got two sheets of these um, I have friends that have, have um, recently had babies so um, I'm going to use these to make some albums bit of a spoiler there if any of my friends are watching and uh, this one here from the same collection oh baby this one is called so sweet I love this one and the reverse and then the only other thing that I got from this same collection was the um, 12 by 12 um, cardstock stickers um, from, again, from the Oh Baby collection. And these are so cute. Um, and these are perfect because uh, one's had a boy and one's had a girl. So um, these work for both, both scenarios. Um, so still on the baby front, uh, I picked up this uh, Pebbles um, from the Night Night collection and this one is called Sweet Baby Girl and this is so cute, I just love the cutter parts and then these little pins on the back and then also from the Night Night collection, this one is called Ahoy Baby Boy and again it's the 3x4, <coughs> excuse me, the 3x4 cutter parts and the reverse is the same as the the girl one but it's greeny blue pins so that's all the baby papers um then i also i have got quite a lot of the dear lizzie <coughs> excuse me stay colorful collection and um i'm just missing the 12 by 12 papers so i did pick up some of them um in my order so this one here is called uh awesome possum and it's these clouds with, well, the rain clouds with the rainbow rain. And I just love this side. Um, so I got that one. And then I also picked up this from Stay Colourful. And this is called Happy Days. Um, I've mentioned before we are moving. Um, we hopefully, at the end of this month, um, depending on the chain that we're stuck in. Um, so we've got, yeah, so I, I'm documenting sort of the whole um, bits about, you know, things that we remember about our house now um, and stuff that we want to remember sort of when we move and, you know, in later years. So I picked this one up because of the houses and I'll be fussy cutting those, but I also love this back, uh, the B-side as well on this um, and the, the branding strip is perfect as well. I uh, got this one, which is the four by four cut apart and this one is called Banana Seat. I have no idea why um, and then the reverse is this gorgeous daisy pattern on a teal uh, this one here is called bell bottom blue and it's a lovely floral pattern um, or a grid pattern on the reverse uh, this one here is called Farrah forever I hope I've pronounced that correctly, um, but anything butterfly related, although I hate butterflies, um, anything butterfly related paper wise that I can fussy cut out, um, it does go a long way to make additional embellishments. And then on the back it's this pink with white spots. And then the final one I got from the Stay Colourful collection is this one called Jive Talking. And this is just all cut apart elements, um, some tags, 4x4, four 3x4s. Four, four um, some strips as well and I do love the reverse of this as well which is a blue uh, with little green white and yellow and purple crosses so this is the main reason that I put the order in um, is because I did want some of the new Wish Upon a Star um, collection from Echo Park so I picked up the 12 by 12 sticker sheet and this will go along with my other Disney items I picked up the 3x4 um, cut apart sheet as well. I don't know if this has a name. Uh, it just says 3x4 uh, journaling cards and the back super cute as well. Reminds me of um, Frozen. So if you, I could could have used this for a Frozen layout, but I'm going to be cutting these apart. This one here is probably my favourite. And it's got all of these, um, it looks like flare badges, just a bit bigger. Um, so all these little circles on. Again, these are going to be great for fussy cutting and uh, the back is just a simple black and white polka dot it's a bit trippy on the eyes this one's called best day buttons 
And then the final 12 by 12 paper I got was this one called Tickets. Um, and look at these little hearts with the, um, the Mickey Mouse um, trouser bit in the bottom, which is so cute. And then the reverse of this is are these tickets. Um, and my uh, thought on this again is to fussy cut all of these out and use these as additional embellishments. So I got all of those um, from the uh, papers, all the papers I bought. Now, I did also buy, and I'm just going to see if I can grab the um, the invoice for it as well, and I'll give you some prices on these. So the papers were about a pound each. Um, I also bought a bag of 12 by 12 bags. Um, they were selling these. I'm just going to see if I can quickly see how much these were. So 10... Um, 10 grip seal bags was £1.25 so I bought two lots of them um, because these are absolutely perfect um, I store my collections in these and I'm out so um, I bought um, yeah, 20 of these grip seal bags for um, extra collections that don't have a home at the moment next up I could not resist travellers uh, travellers notebooks um, these are the blank inserts um, and these are also from the uh, Once Upon a Time, uh, sorry, Once Upon a Time, Wish Upon a Star collection. Um, these are, I love these, look at them. These were $7.99 for the two, um, which I think is fairly inexpensive to pay £4 um, for each traveller's notebook. No, £8.99, sorry. Um, so these were effectively £4.50 each. And these are the two that I got. So there were three available. There were the blank, I think the grid and the lined. So these ones are the blank ones. And um, yeah, the paper quality... It's okay, it's not the thickest, um, but it's certainly not the thinnest ones that I've had. You get lots of paper in these, and the um, the covers of the notebooks are like a textured material, um, but I absolutely love these, and I could not pass them up. Um, I may go back and get the other ones as well, because they were all cute. Um, so yeah, I got the Echo Park Traveller's Notebook blank insert, so you get 32 sheets in each. Then I picked up some more bits from the um, Oh Baby. So I, that all of what I showed you in terms of the um, the papers that I got um, is um, is all that, all that I got from the um, from this collection. But I did buy the die cut ephemera as well, the bits and pieces, and I won't get them out because they'll just go everywhere. So I'll just give you a bit of a close up. And I got all these also from the Oh Baby collection. These are the um, four by four by six sticker sheets you get eight in here and these were oh they were 3.99 sorry the, the last item these ones were 4.99 but you get eight sticker sheets in here um and again these coordinate lovely with um the, the papers so i'll just give you a quick glimpse of um our oh, tiny word stickers one of my favorites so yeah, you get eight sheets of stickers in there for $4.99, which I thought was really, really good. Next up, I got the chipboard accents um, from Echo Park, and these were $3.99. So again, just going in with my Disney stash. Um, I've still got my Disney holidays to document. Um, I've I've made a start on them. I'm you know I'm sort of I'm getting there a little bit, but um, yeah, it's uh, it's taken its toll. That's for sure. And then the other thing that I got with the um, from the Echo Park Wish Upon a Star were the frames and tags, um, which were four ninety nine. And then I also got this. It says Traveller's Notebook Ephemera. Um, and you get 33 pieces in each of these. But this is just a normal ephemera pack. So it doesn't necessarily have to go in with the Traveller's Notebook. Um, so that is what you get in that one. And then this is what you get in the frames and tags one. And I love these. I bought the pink paisley ones for the pick me up collection the ones that were white and navy and i just love the size of them so this side you've got a um a gold color um on white foam and then this side you've got a navy foam with like a rose gold and i absolutely love these and i know that um i don't need any more thickers but these um are great um the small i love the small size on these so i picked those ones up next i got the thickers from the um, Here and There collection and um, I've got some more of the other Here and There collection already 
but I wanted to, um, I didn't have these, um, so I managed to pick these up from Hey Little Magpie, and these were 4 99 So, yeah, just some really usable um, puffy word and um, puffy icon stickers to go with some travel layouts. Um, next I got, um, I got some Nouveau crystal drops and this colour is, it was the gold colour, bright gold. Um, I do want the glittery gold as well but um, I, they did, they, it was out of stock when I, um, when I had a look so I just ordered this one um, for the minute and this one was 2 99 which I think is very, very good value um, for the Nouveau crystal drops. So I got that one to add to my collection. I also got a Tombow Mono uh, liquid glue um, to give this a go as well. Um, I'm having a bit of a love-hate relationship with liquid glues at the moment, so I wanted the Tombow one, so I thought I'd get that to try it out. And I believe that was £4.99, £4.69, sorry. I picked up another Heidi Swap um, colour shine. This one is in the black. This Wild Child um, paper pad. And I believe this was, again, I'm not 100% sure. I think it was um, £3.49. There we are. And there's 36 sheets in this, all single-sided. Um, and I think it's 12 sheets, just on repeat three times. Um, but I just love this. And I've got some of the other elements from um, the Wild Child the Girl collection. This one's the girl one. Um, so I'm going to use that to go with it. And then the final thing that I got uh, were these stickers, and these are called, they're called Caroline. Oh, I love these. Um, I love word stickers, and they make great titles. I think the only downside with this is um, it says Valentine and Valentine's Day um, in there, so I'm not too sure how many how many Valentine and Valentine's Day um, word stickers that I can use. Um, but I love some of the other sentiments. So love you, my, be mine, yours truly. And then on the reverse, you've got hugs and kisses, sweetie, like you, best friend, me and you. So there's some other very, very usable ones in here. Um, anyway, so that is my Hey Little Magpie haul. I don't need any excuses to buy any more items. Um, I just fancy some new stuff and they had a voucher code on. So thank you very much for watching. Any questions you have, please leave them in the comments down below um, I will leave a link for Hey Little Magpie in the description bar down below this video is not sponsored in the slightest but I do like to promote um, UK scrapbooking companies as and where I can um, so give this video a thumbs up helps me be found on YouTube by other people and I'll see you all very very soon bye